To begin with, we will start with creating a new application. To create a new application, there is a simple command in Ionic. We'll go to the console and write this command Ionic start my app blank. This will create a new blank application. This, in this project, we will create a new application and change the fonts of So yes, our new application is being created. You can see the application has been done. And we'll import this application inside the IDE. So here are all the files. We'll go inside the app and we'll start the app by the command ionic serve minus C. This will make the application run in the browser. So yeah, this is it. Our application is running in the browser. The simple blank application. I will just add few text here. Say we are testing fonts here. I'll change the P tag to H3. Just save and refresh. Yeah, so it's done. Now go to Google and search for the Google fonts. I will add the Google fonts in this application. Yeah. So you can see there is a huge array of fonts to choose from. You can choose whatever fonts you like. Choose any of the fonts. Select it. We have to go and select this font. You can see below on the right hand side you will find all the details. Now go back to our application. In the application we have to browse to themes and variable file. Right. You can see all the CSS stuff here. Go to the bottom. I have one code snippet. I will paste this here. I have used this in one of the application. The font's name is Oxygen. We will just test this. Save and refresh. You can see the fonts are being changed. Now coming back to the fonts which we selected. You have to change the name of the font. Just copy paste. The font family name. It won't reflect right now because we haven't changed the URL yet. So we have to copy the font URL and paste it over here like this still it won't reflect because we are yet to change the font family name so we have to just copy the font name and paste it down here save and refresh yes our fonts are changed now so it was so it is very very simple and easy to change Now let's go back here and select some another font. See this one, Mountains of Christmas. Okay. We'll say select this font. Yes. And again, we will do the same thing. Copy the URL, font family name and font name. Yes, we'll copy the URL. Copy the font family name. Then the font name just below it. Now 
Yes. And we are done. Save and refresh. I hope you like this video.